so hi guys happy week day to all of you guys i am may max and welcome to my channel if you're new here please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and if you like my contents i usually post three times a week usually tuesday thursday or saturday right now i am 38 weeks and five days pregnant i'm not sure you know science wise but today i am going to show you what i got for target and how i score them cheap so this all of this is um only i only paid 70 dollars for every single one of them and i will try to show you guys what the original price individual packs so basically this is my i don't know if you can see it i'm trying to wait here so according here i saved 65 dollars 65 dollars for all of this stuff that i bought so i will show you or i will tell you what I did to save that money for baby products because you know first are so expensive and also wipes so you are going to teach you is um, how to save money in Target um, Target wise they said that when you're a mom you became Target obsessed so that's basically what happened to me since I found out I was pregnant, I'm already stacking up on diapers and wipes so that I'm not gonna pay full price for it when it comes to time that I already have my daughter. So, I'm, I haven't paid any full price on any of the diapers that I bought and even wipes. But I'm planning to do do-it-yourself wipes. So, this one, I... If you don't know how to coupon, I would definitely suggest for you to coupon and treat those coupons as your hard-earned money. I go to coupon.com and then print some coupons there. I do use two accounts. So I use two email addresses and then I print those um, I print those separately. So I use two to three accounts usually if I really want to save money, but yeah, I use one of my email and then other email and I print those off and use them um, same as if it's a dollar off, it's gonna be a dollar off and you can usually use them four times for each product. So that's what I did as time goes by, I accumulated those coupons and use them a target and then on top of that there are some coupons that I got from bags. Um, and I just use them just because, you know, I don't want to spend a lot of money. And especially, they're just going to poop and pee on it anyways. It's not like it's going to stay there forever. So for this one, for this Pampers, I got a dollar off coupon for them. So I ended up paying 99 cents for each of these. So plus tax. So this is basically 99 cents and Target was giving away $30 for every $100 spent. So I spent $100 uh, minus all the coupons that I used. So as I've said, I only paid $73 and that $73.21 including tax instead of paying almost $135 for all of this. And then this one a seventh generation diaper i got newborn just in case and you can always exchange it like if you need a different size you can always exchange it to target as long as you have a baby registry with them so make sure that you document all of this put it on your registry with the receipt number so make sure you have your receipt and put your receipt number on it and then add it on your baby registry so once you add it on your baby registry you can exchange it up to a year or you can return them up to a year as long as it is in your baby registry so this one is a newborn just in case she's going to use newborn for a while i don't know who knows because she's still in my belly so this one, instead of me paying $11.99, um, 
I ended up paying, I have a $5 coupon plus $2, so I have a $7 coupon. So I ended up paying $4 each, if I'm not mistaken, right? Yeah. Yeah, I ended up paying $3.46, according here. If you use those $5 coupon and the $2 coupon. And then on top of that, I do have Ibota. So I get cashbacks there too. And then, so yeah, I have three. I got this for $3.46. You know, like you want to save money. So this is a $3.46. So the $2 coupon, you can only use it for two um, diapers. So this one, I only use the $5 coupon for this. So this is size one. And so I only paid $5.99 for each for this since I have the $5. Actually, $6.99 because it's $5. It's $11.99 minus $5. So those two is $5 and then the other one is $3.46. And then for Huggies, this is... Um, if I'm not mistaken, this is this is actually $8.99 and then I do have $2 coupons. So I ended up paying yeah. I ended up paying $4.64 because there's a uh, manufacturer's coupon for $2. So I have a Target coupon plus manufacturer's coupon. So I only ended up paying $4 for one Huggies, which is supposedly almost $9. So that's a deal there. Which is the Huggies Health Care Wipes. I just want to use this part, that's why I bought it. And then there's free wipes inside. $3.99 and then I do have the coupon for $0.50. Cent. So this one ended up being $2.81. So you can use it when you go out with your baby. Lastly, I got Pamper Sensitive. So this one doesn't have the flap on it, but it has 448. It's heavy. But this one is 448 um, wipes rather than the other one that has like flap. So the difference is they don't have this one. They just have the normal paper thingy. And that one is 392 pieces. And then this one is 448 pieces. So I opted this one just because it's more. The more the merrier. And then I do have this Pampers Swaddlers. And it's size 4 because I already bought a lot of size 1, 2, and 3. So I'm stacking up on size 4. Just in case, and as I've said, you can always return it after a year if you add it on the re your registry. So I added every, I added all of this. Only, I only paid, this is originally $11.59 and then I do have a coupon for that and it's only, so I ended up paying $6.55 for this one, but that doesn't include the tax. And then I did purchase the Pam Pampers diapers. And there's a coupon there for a, for five dollars if I buy if I buy this and this that ended up being thirteen dollars and seventy five cents according here. And then as I've said, they gave away thirty dollars free um, gift card, so my savings is almost half, um, which is sixty five dollars, and I only paid seventy three dollars for hundred thirty five dollar item. So guys, that's it it for today. Hopefully, you get your couponing game on. As I have said, it helps a lot. No. Like, dollars is dollars. It's your hard-earned money. So if there's any way that you can save, I would definitely suggest for you to, you know, to take advantage of that because even though it's a cent, it's still a cent. You'll never be a millionaire without a cent. You know what I mean? So yes, guys. Bye, and I'll see you in my next video. Please do like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. And this is May Mags, and may you all have a magnificent day. Bye.